Uh, Judith Cohen in Aventura writes to the Miami Herald this morning. You'll love this. <laughs> Listen, the heading is wrong word choice. Uh. Ray Leslie Abravanel's April 9 column, New Yorkers have planned to boil you over. I was extremely disappointed in the choice of words to describe the people who may frequent the Ivy restaurant in Aventura. Oi! The term yenta is derogatory and bigoted. The yentas who subscribe to the Herald frequent the restaurants and support upscale merchants are the ones who make Miami a desirable place to visit. Why choose to offend, asks Judith. Let me answer your question, Judith, yenta. <laughs> See, yenta is not just an offensive word. It also is accurate. And not only that, but first of all, how many yentas are there really in Miami? Aventura ain't Miami, honey. But if you're talking about South Florida, the yentas are one of the reasons that this place is so disgusting and despicable and obnoxious. Just like the yentas who were gathered at Pompano Park last Saturday in the lobby there, screaming and hollering for their free programs. That's a yenta, okay? That's a kvetch. Oh, no, that's my mother, a professional victim. But at any rate, <laughs> is this perfect? Oh, man. Why choose to offend? In other words, the truth hurts, Judith and Aventura. Okay, you can't handle it. It's obnoxious. It's disgusting. The behavior is subhuman. I wish I had her problem. Don't be a yenta, okay? Oi! 